All right, folks, I have had a lot of questions from folks about what CPU coolers are compatible with the new tension. And to be honest with you, I don't fully know the answer yet. Um, I will say um, that I bought five 10th gen CPUs from Intel. Okay. And out of the ones shown here, uh, three of the four all had the same CPU cooler as uh, 9th gen, 8th gen. Uh, if you see that, they all have that same part number. Now, the i7 had this uh, much more spiffy looking CPU cooler. However, uh, it pretty much looks like the same thing with an upgraded cord and uh, it's been blacked out. So of course, you know, the bottom of these look like they do and the bottoms of the other uh, CPU coolers that I'm going to test in the future um, are not, you know, set up like this. So we've got We've got this uh, rather cheap CPU cooler available on Amazon uh, that I will try out later and I'll give you guys some feedback. And then if I can get motivated to take my awesome Noctua apart, um, and assuming I can find all the parts that go with it, um, we will test that out in a later video. But hey, if you are actually uh, watching this video and you have... Uh, I don't know, let's say concrete proof that LGA 1151 CPU coolers are compatible with LGA 1200. I uh, would love to see those comments and or if uh, you know there's any other videos out there that uh, we can steer our YouTube friends to. But hey, that's all I have. Um, I know it doesn't help a lot that I, I probably didn't answer your question, um, bringing up more, more questions, but... Uh, when I get the answer, folks, I will uh, either link another video down below or I will, you know, put it, uh, pin it at the top. All right. Hey, thanks for checking out my video. Please like, please subscribe. Thank you.